my name is Eileen Perez and I'm an astrophysicist and this is facts about comets in the solar system. So most of comets come from the Oort cloud and I will talk uh, briefly about their anatomy so you and I will throw in some facts about their parts. So the main part of a comet is the nucleus and is commonly referred as a dirty snowball. And it actually ranges from the sizes of between 100 meters to about 40 kilometers. So it can change very drastically in size. Now, it has two tails, but the only time that you see the tails is when it's close to the sun. And one of the tails is the ion tail, and the other one is the dust tail. Now, there are uh, some of the travelers in the solar system that actually have stable orbits around the sun. Uh, we generally refer to comets with periods less than 200 years. So if a period is less than 200 years, we refer to them as short period. If they have a period greater than 200 years, we refer to them as long period comets. And these generally are not really bound by the sun. They could have different types of orbits as well. Uh, the most famous comet that we know is Halley, the Halley Comet. And it has a period of 75 years, it's actually between 75 and 76 years. We believe that we have over 4,000 comets in the solar system. And uh, one of the most important comets uh, that brought a lot of evidence um, about life on, in, in the solar system is Wild 2. So Wild 2 was really interesting because uh, when we studied the composition of the Wild 2 comet, uh, we realized that it had the building blocks of life. There has been um, a theory about what brought life onto the planets, and it could have been that comets were actually the, the ones that spread out the building blocks of life. And Wild 2 sort of brought evidence of that. My name is Helene Perez, and I'm an astrophysicist, and these are some facts about comets. Thank you.